this strife is over, Christ has risen. Hallelujah song resonates the length and breadth of the world for the victory of Jesus over death. Peace be with you. Beyond the joy and fanfare heralded by his resurrection, Jesus died for a purpose and it is to save the world and reconcile mankind to God following the fall in the Garden of Eden. And as a Christian community across the world basking in the fear of Jesus' resurrection, faithful are reminded of the important needs to imbibe the teachings and essence of the auspicious celebration. For Pastor Lushegun Yetayo, Easter is a clear demonstration of God's love, urging faithful to dedicate themselves to Christ in appreciation of his love. You know, when our Lord Jesus Christ came, he came and he was called Emmanuel. God with us. But by his death and resurrection, he became God for us. He gave everything, even unto us. So what is expected of us as Christians at this moment is to dedicate our life, even to this one who has shown this love unto us. In his submission, Pastor Muyua Lunge said the victory of Jesus over death has given Christians eternal hope but entreated them to dignify the occasion by reassessing their faith and journey with God. With his promise that is coming, we need to look at our lives. We need to reflect on it. Things that we need to do rightly, we should look at them and do them rightly. And daily, we should be expecting that coming. Other clerics, Christiana Awoyemi and Abayo Miolaya, asserted that Christ has given adherents of Christian faith the confidence of life and resurrection and to save the world from calamities. We will be alive with the Lord Jesus Christ because we are going to, there is a continuity of life. Life is never taken away completely. There is a continuity of life and we will continue to live with the Lord Jesus Christ. And not only that, physically, you know the world is full of evil now. It is the Lord Jesus Christ that we have uh, confidence in to see us through. We are really expecting the impact of that resurrection. One, to show love. Two, to really live by the word of Christ. Then another point there is that the power of resurrection that kills sins, that destroy evil, should be made known or should be, uh, we should begin to be thirsty after it. The celebration continues with Jesus meeting his disciples in Galilee where he gave them the great commission to go into the world to preach the gospel and baptize with an assurance of being with them till the end of the world. Richard, listen to me, OSR News.